What's up everybody, it's uh, BC, Brian Costello. Welcome to my channel if it's your first video. I do real estate videos, sales videos, confidence, lifestyle, cars, anything and everything that has to do with building a good lifestyle for yourself and becoming financially free. So, I want to make a video today on Mayweather and McGregor, right? I caught most of the fight and I wanted to break down, right, in a very simple fashion a great learning lesson for a lot of people and exactly why Mayweather beat McGregor. I already knew Mayweather would win. Now, uh, we can go ahead and, and put to the side all the arguments of it being rigged, this and that. Uh, to a certain extent, I kind of agree with you guys. I think it was obviously a marketing genius ploy or whatever they did to uh, cause what they caused. They both made a lot of money. And let's put that to the side, okay? Because we can argue about that all day, okay? What I want to talk about is the concepts and the reason that Mayweather beat McGregor. Okay, I know a lot of you are McGregor fans and I think he's a phenomenal fighter, except this, okay? He, I made a post on Facebook about this. He agreed to fight on the Masters territory, he fought in Vegas, by his rules. And you never do that until you are at the Masters level, right? Let's say a Master teaches you you're his student, and you want to challenge him right away based on his rules, you're not there yet, right? And everything is in favor of the master. You're fighting on his territory, by his rules, his way, his specific sequence, which is what this fight was, right? I'm trying to break this down uh, in the simplest way possible. But basically you're agreeing to fight the way he wants, where he wants, how he wants, and you don't do that. <clears throat> Okay, McGregor's a phenomenal fighter. However, he's not technically as skilled as Mayweather in boxing. He's fighting him in Vegas by his rules. And that's why Mayweather won. You see, you guys have to remember that we're all gonna be better at different things, but you wanna be a strategist in life. You don't wanna just go around challenging everybody for no reason. Now, a couple people challenged me on the Facebook post, but what they have said I don't know if you guys had read it. They had said a bunch of dumb stuff, but what they were referring to was the exception to the rule. Like, oh, you know, I'm that one guy, blah, 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 blah. Okay, maybe you are. But even if you are that one guy, you're the exception to the rule. And if all of you want to say that, I'll dare you. And I challenge you to live your life based on the exception to the rule and watch what happens, right? Like, you know that, uh, for example, let's say that water obviously uh, nourishes us and is a great... Um, you know, very healthy liquid that we need to drink. It gives us life, it fights disease, it hydrates us. But let's say you want to live drinking soda, good luck. Because you might be that exception to the rule, that one person who maybe can survive off soda. Or that one guy who can eat hamburgers every day and survive. You get where I'm going with this. Mayweather was a genius for doing it. Now again, it might have been a marketing gimmick, you know, a total, totally rigged fight, sure. But what I'm saying is the concept here. If you're gonna step up to a master, play by his rules and in his territory, make sure that you yourself are ready. McGregor's a great fighter, technically skilled as Mayweather, definitely not in boxing. And we saw the result. Mayweather played it perfectly. And then right in the end, boom, he pounced on him, fight over. So, the lesson is, you have to be a strategist, but at the same time, pick your battles. Pick your battles, right? I'm not gonna be a brand new real estate agent, I'm a realtor, if you're a new person watching this, and I'm not gonna challenge the number one real estate agent in the world my first week. That would be foolish. Same thing, I'm not gonna be a, a, a black belt kung fu fighter and then suddenly say, you know what, Mr. Boxer, let's, let's go box, we'll play by your rules, I have to fight boxing style, you know, and uh, I'll kick your ass doesn't make sense it does not make sense so take a look at what you're doing right any scenario coming up and you need to anticipate McGregor didn't anticipate well he didn't look ahead and prepare well enough and think and say okay how is this gonna work right so I highly recommend you guys do that very thing and strategize and not fight on the master's territory and by his rules because you're shooting yourself in the foot. 
unless in that moment you yourself are a master in the same thing, then maybe, but the other guy is still in an advantage because you're in his territory and you're fighting by his rules, okay? I don't want to make this video too long, but I just wanted to put a... Uh, shed some light on the situation and give you guys kind of like an educational thing from it because people uh, don't look at it that way and I, I looked at it that way from the beginning and I even though I didn't really support the fight too much I already knew already that Mayweather would win based on these things that I'm telling you in these concepts so I hope you learned something from it I know I did and uh, yeah make sure you guys like the video subscribe to the channel and I will see you on the next one um, and I'll continuously do my best now to find these things that are happening in life and then bring them and give you guys a, uh, a lesson from it. Okay. Modern success debuts tonight, 5 PM Pacific standard time. Highly recommend you get on it. Link is in the description. Also these glasses, you can get them on my website. Now I have the direct link also in the description.